Hi, I'm Doug. I've been a fitness and rehabilitation professional for 29 years. When we think about lack of balance in an elderly client, uh, this is someone that might not have had a stroke, doesn't have Parkinson's disease, didn't have a head injury, but still they're having a lot of trouble balancing themselves. With these people, and I would tell you that this is probably the majority of older people, it's a question of losing the skill. Of course, when they were younger, they were able to balance themselves and play football and do all sorts of things. But as they've gotten older, they've stopped doing activities. A lot of times as people get into their 70s and definitely into their 80s, a lot of people will just stop doing activities. They'll stop going for walks outside. They'll stop playing golf. Maybe they have other health problems that cause them to, to make that choice but a lot of times they've stopped doing these higher level activities. And the effect is, is that they've lost the opportunity to practice balance activities. They are not using the programming that they acquired throughout their life to do these higher level skills. So over time, they actually lose those skills because they're not practiced often enough. And this of course is where neuroelastic training comes in to present opportunities where they can safely practice those higher level balance activities again and quickly regain their sense of balance. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to see more videos like this. If you wanna access my full training course, click the link below in the description. This is not physical therapy or medical training. It is not meant to be medical advice to anyone. It is intended only as educational information for trainers and therapists. No one should ever perform an exercise without consulting with their doctor or medical professional.